Right, so your orange might start to be looking a little bit like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rub out all the guidelines now. I'll keep my arrow because that's going to help me with my accuracy. Okay, and you might have drawn all your sections and segments in there. I like to leave a little bit of a gap between some of my segments and look very closely at my sheet. I can see some little white areas. So I like to leave a gap there. So that means my tonal work later will be better. So job one is rub out all these guidelines. We don't need them now. You might not have sketched in your seeds. So you can see these little seeds inside there. If you look really closely, you can see these actual stripes of tone. So I'm just going to do some lines that come up and down like this. And that's going to add some nice shapes to do toning. Don't worry about your tone today. Right, we've got a nice light bit on this seed and then a dark bit that's here. We're just drawing the detail. A lot of people get a bit confused how to draw these sort of veins. So think of them as shapes, not lines. And you're going to draw lines that connect through like this and our solid shapes, just like we did with the Aboriginal art. Um, we did bubble symbols, so we could add colour. We're going to do bubble veins, so we can add lots of tones later on. The next tip I'm going to give you for this lesson is to make sure your pencil is really sharp, and then that way we can get that very fine detail coming in. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's just giving us the idea of those lovely veins coming through. And that's going to help us get a better colour piece at the end as well, which you'll be doing. And then the next thing I want to do is on this bit of peel here, there are little tiny circles and shapes. So I'm going to start to put them in. Now they're not perfect. So mine won't be perfect. And I'm looking at each triangle as I go around. And that's going to help me with that. And if you imagine that I've done that and that all the way around, my drawing will be finished. If you finish your drawing today, don't add any tone. We're going to photocopy the pictures first. So you can do a nice little extension activity 